Hello Lilas, welcome to my channel. If you guys are here, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. Go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. And if you feel inclined to, go ahead and leave me a comment in the section below. Also guys, if you want to join the Chatterbox for a stream, no, exclusive live streams, then please click the link in the description bar below. Anyway guys, you are watching Baby Nick. And Baby Nicholas is the Lee Sculpt by Priscilla Lopez. And he was painted by myself and professionally rooted by my rooter. Um, he, I did have a request. This is him without his uh, binky. He is a boy, even though he got a head full of hair. Um, just the boys in my family always had so much hair. So, um... <clears throat> Well, I think we had like one that didn't, but, but anyway, but for the most part, they usually are born with a lot of hair and they, as they get older, they have like a whole head full of hair. So this was a special request to get baby Nicholas changed into something different and just to do a change of video. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Um, I really like him in this, uh, this print. But I'm going to change him. He's, he does need to be changed. He hasn't been changed in a while. I do realize that the camera is showing him shiny. He is not like shiny. He does have a satin like finish on him where it's a sheen. Like he's lotioned. He's not. Um, but he's not shiny. But you know how that goes. So this is... Um, one of the things I did with him is I felt like this baby looked a little bit older than the actual size. So I gave him about maybe two more inches or so on to his body. So I put him on a little bit longer body to give him a bigger baby look because I just felt like it fit. And um, it does. It looks... It looks better. He feels like his clothes better. Sorry, I get bristles on him. Um, he feels like his clothes better. And I'm also going to put this little uh, powder wafer in his diaper. So, but yeah. So sometimes you can do that. Even like with real like preemie um, vinyl kits. Or even your cloth body silicone kits if you change them. I don't usually change out the bodies on my silicone babies this often but if I had to I would but even with those if you you know want them to be able to wear like small newborn clothes you can put them on a little bit longer just a tad bit longer body and that will allow them to be able to wear you know bigger clothes and that that's what you know that's what um I've done in the past because of shopping and all that and stuff so he has a little bum bum let's see So he has, he has a little bum bum and of course he has my little signature there. Um, he does have a heartbeat as well. <laughs> my mom said his eyes look too real when she, she came over. Um, but yeah, I'm going to put him on this little onesie that Mary sent. She sent some onesies for the babies. And I'm going to put him on one of those. And right now, I'm just going to put him on a onesie, I think. I could have put him on, you know, I could have put him on the whole, got him dressed, put him on socks and shoes and all that. I'll do that in another time in another video. I like to see his feet hanging from the high chair because that's normally where he sits. I like him in that spot. I specifically kept him so that he could sit in that hot chair <laughs> so um I just forgot to put it in there. but this also when I put these in here it also I don't want to get the oils on my hand it also allows the room to, to smell like baby because the baby is on in the babies. I just can't have it too loud because like I said, my migraines and those those wafers are very strong. 
they do die down over time so that's a good thing um but if i'm migrating or on the verge of migrating i don't want to be to a point where i can't come into the nursery because of the smell is so strong so i don't do a lot of scented too too scented stuff very light for you know baby powder scents is okay um So you also want to be considerate of that, especially if you're an artist and you're selling a baby. You don't want to overdo it with the the smell goods. I know we love them and all that, and opening up the box is wonderful. But I wish you guys could see his little homes. He's the cutest little homes. They look so cute. I made sure I, I painted them really um, a nice color flesh color so this is what he's gonna wear since he's gonna wear so yep I'm not gonna put him on socks or anything I'm throw this away and um yeah I'm not gonna put him on socks or anything like that I may put him back on his bed just because I like him having it doesn't match but I, I like him having this on, so when I have him in the room, it has my, my name, my nursery name. It's good for when I do videos and it shows really nicely just to have it say Miss Serenity Smith. <laughs> I know that's so cocky, right? It's always got to be all about me. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed watching baby Nicholas. Um, yeah, he's a really nice sculpt. Um, I love the way everything on him is sculpted. I really do. I love his, his complete sculpt. But anyway, guys, like I said, thanks for watching. I hope you guys have a great day.